Hey guys, this is Mike from B-Tech Reviews here, and today we take a look at a screen protector from AM Film. Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. So today we are going to take a look at a screen protector that they sent to me uh, from a company called TechMate. So I'm gonna leave all the uh, affiliate links in the description below, guys. These are actually relatively uh, cheap, um, I guess, tempered glass screen protectors that you can get for your for your phones here. Uh, these are literally under uh, $10, and the brand there is called TechMate. That's probably what I'll put in the description there, but let's go ahead and, and take a look here. I am gonna do a drop test for you guys, just so you can see what's going on. I've actually never done a drop test here, uh, but we're gonna do it with my personal iPhone here, at LOL. Just kidding, so if you guys, uh, it was cool of them to send me a dummy iPhone. This is just a fake iPhone, it actually looks kind of raw. I wanna say it's modeled after a like a, Pro, a 13 Pro device or Maybe it's a 15 Pro, I'm not sure, but this is like my, this is my regular iPhone. It's about the same size minus the case, right? Um, has that triple camera setup and everything. Looks just like an iPhone, has an iPhone logo on it and everything like that. It has a power button on it. Um, funny because it does have like, I guess, USB type C stuff. Pretty much anything that you would see in an iPhone, right? They basically just modeled it after SIM card tray and everything like that. The little, you know, the little lock screen there or whatever. Not really, but anyways, you know, that's a, that's something that I can throw around and, and not be worried about too, too much. Um, but yeah, they reached out to me and they sent me this uh, again, you know, so we're going to get this installed here on the dummy phone here. Let's go ahead and take a look at the contents of the inside real quick. They sent me uh, two packs uh, or I guess two, two boxes of the twin packs and whatnot. So I'm going to go ahead and just kind of just use one. I might use the other one for my phone itself, right? But again, these are tempered glass uh you know i don't know if it's a case or what but let's take a look here i'm not 100 percent sure what's going on here it looks like we're getting lots of stuff out of the box here so let's take a look here hold on okay this is interesting i mean so it says top uh, let's take a look at this tempered glass tempered glass okay so again i'm not 100 sure what's going on with this like it's a two-pack right but i guess it's the way you install it or whatever so <laughs> there's a lot of stuff going on here they even give you a little protector thing for your for uh the camera housing itself right so um that i'll probably say for last of anything like that um they give you two of them actually so pretty cool i guess and they give you kind of like a little small tool to to actually use this so when you're when you're trying to clean and whatnot this is a screen protector installation accessory i'm assuming it's just like the cleaner it comes with two of them guys so just be aware like i'm only going to use one of them i'm going to put one aside here here's the instruction manual right i think i've done enough of these to kind of figure it out although i've never gotten a screen protector that actually goes on like this so that'll be interesting um and i'm probably gonna fill out the instructions here that's okay i, I don't really care it doesn't really matter uh you know these are this is my first time using one of these so it says clean apply and then you're just gonna pull off and then that's it so um press on screen protector let's see begin by cleansing the screen and then pull the tab downwards okay to remove the mask film note pull down pulling outwards may develop something and guys i'm sorry like i'm having a really hard time reading here because uh, my eyes are not as good as they used to be uh place the application uh over the phone screen yada 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 so i guess you have to pull the little thing first interesting interesting okay so let's go ahead and let's let's just go ahead and try cleaning the phone screen first okay guys so again we're gonna use the dummy iphone here i'm not gonna use my real phone maybe i will later on but not right now um because i really don't know if i'm gonna actually use this on my actual device i don't even know if it'll fit my device because i'm the link that they sent me are for um are for uh, that like the uh, the new iphone 15 series so i don't know if these are this is a dummy device for that but in any case, you know, we're going to go ahead and clean this like we normally would, right? Uh, it's like a, they give you like an alcoholic wipe. I, you know, I'm not going to 
do it to the extent where it's going to be perfect but basically this is this is how we're going to clean it right and if you guys are wondering i am filming on the pixel 7 pro over here pretty good not bad and then they give you like this little this little i guess thing to kind of dry it off and clean it off a little bit not too bad not too bad okay i'm gonna adjust the camera here just a smidge my tripod wasn't going down so again as you can see there the that is pretty clean for the most part they do give you like these little i guess these little sticker things there they're like to just remove dust if any dust but basically all they are, are stickers you just put them on there and it comes off I'll, I'll leave all the cleaning material stuff over here so again we're supposed to put this over here as so and i'm not too sure if, again if i'm doing this 100 percent right or not let's see let's find out i don't know if they're supposed to clip in or not if i can be 100 percent honest because i mean it does come with two but i think you know you're only going to get one or whatever and then it says you have to pull something down so again let me let me kind of just lay it down really quick because i don't want to i don't want to mess this up guys let's go back to the instructions really quick okay so we're gonna remove the tab downward so we can remove the mask this is a film that is on the inside of the screen protector so i'm just going to throw that away so after that i'm going to lay down this on the dummy iphone i guess it's pretty cool because it kind of uh it kind of just mimics or I, it, it kind of lays in there kind of like flat like a screen protector would uh, which is pretty cool because like I am not getting I'm not good at aligning these screen protectors and this tool actually does help um, so it says place the application tray over your phone screen uh, the top of the tray aligns with the top of the phone so there you go there is that um, and then it says uh, it says with press uh, the screen protector on the top and slide over slowly so you see how i have my finger here i'm supposed to just slide it forward slowly i don't know i don't know if that's actually doing anything or not but it says press with your finger and it says remove the application tray from the phone by lifting it off now so now we have to we're going to lift this off hopefully it comes off and again i don't know if i was doing that right but you can see here that something's coming off with this don't know what i don't know if that's another plastic cover but as you can see there uh the screen protector is on now of course you can see a big bubble and a big <laughs> cat hair or something i'm not sure what the heck that is on the inside but you know that that did happen that's okay though uh and again i'm gonna assume that this is to remove the air bubbles and anything that that comes out which is pretty cool it's an easy application i'm gonna leave that there guys sorry I, that that that's bugging the heck out of me by the way i don't know i have dogs sorry about that and my dogs uh they shed a lot so so that that bugs me a little bit but the actual the actual i guess screen protector is staying on pretty good no comment there i guess i, I think i maybe forgot to pull off the plastic uh thing that was on top of the actual um like covering the screen protector i guess but that's okay um that's not too too bad honestly and i mean i don't know let's see uh, i might i might do a drop test with this just to kind of see like how good this is as you can see here it is mimicking like the iphone like 14 or 15 pro because it does it doesn't have like the uh the cutout bezel that you would see on top there with like the older models so that's pretty cool again it's just this little hair thing that's bugging the heck out of me which is all right but that that would be the last step right it says to get rid of any bubbles carefully lift the corner nearest the the affected area which would be that but in this case honestly i think i'm just gonna pull it off because it's bu it's bugging the heck out of me and i have like a bunch of these cases to to test test this out with so that was the that was the fall on the first one let's get another one applied really quick okay we are redoing this once again hilarious but that's okay so again like they say they just pull your finger down here as so and i'm gonna take this outside and i'm actually gonna do a drop test for you guys so hopefully and as you can see there like i don't know if you guys saw that in slow motion or not but basically that uh 
there we go that one came off a lot easier this time now i only see one little bubble there which again you know let's i, I guess they give you this little tool to use i don't think it's going to be perfect obviously but it, it, it does install the case relatively nice and very simple i'm actually going to probably use this from now on i have it kind of like as a backup right but i have you know i think it's pretty cool that they send you like this little applicator and now i have this bubble on the bottom which is going to bug the heck out of me but anyways uh you know let's let's go straight to the drop test guys hey guys you can totally see my cats there just chilling by the way there's cheeto there's tiger filming them in 4k just kidding i think i'm shooting in 1080p okay so i do have the dummy iphone here so i am going to do a drop test guys i'm probably going to start maybe kind of low and, and i don't know maybe i should do slow motion or something like that just to kind of show you guys that i'm kind of dropping this on the floor but i'm about 510 59 ish over here this is probably a good like three feet from the ground so i'm just going to literally drop it let's see if it cracks So far, no cracks. It's, you know, got a little scuffed up because of the dirt. Let's try a little bit higher. This is probably at my shoulder, which is probably about like five foot right there. Let's do another drop test. Okay, this one, it landed on its face. It, this one, it did crack a little bit on the side, right? But the purpose is to protect your, your screen and uh, from getting cracked and uh, by, by this screen taking the damage. So again, let's do another test here. <laughs> I think the dummy iPhone, <laughs> the dummy iPhone, the camera bump broke off. Hey, that, hey, they sent me this dummy iPhone, so I'm gonna test it. I should have probably put it in the case, but that's okay. That's okay. Here, let's, let's try a little bit lower drop test, guys, okay? <laughs> And I am doing some damage to this tempered glass screen, guys. That's pretty That's pretty nuts. But uh, let's see if it's doing its job here. I'm going to go ahead and pull it off now. And the sun's going down, so excuse the bad lighting here. Excuse the bad lighting. Here, I'm going to try to peel this off as best as I can. <laughs> so, so as you can see here, you know, I was dropping it a little bit high. This did get a little bit damaged, but you know, I, I am test. I, I, I did want to test out the durability of these uh, screens. You can tell though that, you know, the screens did hold up, you know, it has some sort of film that's protecting it from both sides. So, you know, they just, just didn't break automatically. My dummy iPhone did take some damage also. That's a shame because uh, I, I've never had a dummy iPhone. But anyways, you know, I was dropping it on big ceramic uh, tiles over here whatever you want to call them uh, on the outside i wasn't dropping it directly on concrete i wasn't dropping stuff on here you know what i mean i uh, granted i was going to put a case on here uh but that, i just didn't i decided not to just because i wanted to see okay you know just how much uh damage this would take and as you can see there you can see the cracks there on on the screen right there so did, d definitely didn't do very fairly well around the five foot mark you know um but anyways you know if you have a case on this and you still have a screen protector you're still going to do some some pretty good protection on your phone screen itself guys so again this is mike from b tech reviews i am going to go ahead and link up the affiliate link down below so you guys can check it out uh for these and again i i have had other screen protectors in the past uh that you know i put on and they still crack but and the fact is you know they're going to protect uh, you know the main screen in this case, you know again this one did get a little bit cracked So, you know feedback for whoever did send this to me that you know Obviously, they're not a hundred percent shock proof. But anyways guys Mike for B tech review signing off. Thanks again for checking out the video smash the like button We'll see you guys next time